Oh, how are y'all doing? <laughs> I'm in the quarantine dorm because I got exposed to a single person. You're not too early. I mean, it's, it's it is when it started. I have a wheelie chair. Also, I'm sorry I keep spinning, but um, I'm in the quarantine dorm. Also, this camera quality is probably horrible because there's no light in, like, this little area. But it's okay. We're vibing. Not really. It's- it is a scary place in here. Um, my bed sheets are very scary. Oh, I can even turn the camera. There's my bed. It's scary. The sheets they give me- they gave me are very scary. Um. <laughs> I don't know what that com like combination of emojis mean, but all right. I have my sink with stuff that way, and then behind me I have my random school stuff along with my box. For if I need to use the restroom, I have to bring disinfectant with me to the community bathroom. See. <laughs> I'd be fine with this if my friend didn't fucking get like, cause he's also in isolation, but he's in the second, he's in another isolation dorm. He got like an, a massive fucking room with his own bathroom, a microwave and a fridge. I'm like, whoa, 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 whoa. That is not fair. But um, yep, we're just, we're just here. I don't know, I'll be streaming a lot. I might do a full day stream. Who knows? I don't have a roommate. Knock on wood. Uh, at least there's no roommate here now. But I am able to get one. So. I uh, knocked my earbud out. I feel like if people hear me from like the other sides of the rooms or out the door, it's gonna sound like I'm insane just talking to myself. Like, day one in quarantine, I'm already losing my memory. <laughs> um, yeah, no, it kind of sucks, especially having to do, like, a walk of shame, essentially, because, like, I had to walk from my dorm to this one, and it, like, with my, all of my stuff, I can't go back to my room. It's, I'm locked out until 
I get approved to go back. So, woo. <laughs> I mean, college is pretty good. It was literally one person is the thing. I got exposed to like a single person. It wasn't even I didn't go to a party. I didn't go to like a huge event. It was one person. So that really sucked actually, but I don't know. I mean, it's also like seeing the difference between here, like at Virginia Tech, like there's not huge gatherings and shit, but like at where my friend is and he keeps posting on his fucking snap story about it. Like he's going to these massive fucking concerts and shit where nobody's wearing masks and like they're packed together and I get it's Alabama. I get they don't really give a shit there. But it's like, we're still in a pandemic. Like, <laughs> the fact that I got it from one person, it's just insane. Like, I've been so fucking careful. I've worn my mask everywhere, and I get exposed to one person. And then he goes to concerts and shit, and it doesn't seem like anything's happening to him. So it's kind of, like, cool. Love that for me. <sighs> I mean, college is good other than that. I mean, it'll help me get a degree to be- to work in the lab, which is what I want to do. But, I had to drop- oh, I'm moving the camera. I had to drop my neuro class, just because it was- I was taking too many credits, and it was not smart. To be fair, I was taking 20 credits, which is one over. Most people normally average about 14-15 credits, which is where I'm at now, because I also dropped a different math class, so I'm taking that over the summer as well. But it's like, huh. I don't know, it just- it really sucks. Like, I'm in a sorority, and, like, literally, we haven't had any in-person events at all. We've had all virtual, and, like, even our basket week, which is where you're supposed to get, like, these cute little baskets with goodies and stuff, of, like, from someone who's your big, so, like, your big sister, essentially. They canceled that. It's all online, too, now. And it's, like, if a huge sorority can transfer it to be online then, like, I feel like you can definitely avoid a concert for still a while. I don't know. It just sucks. How are you doing, Austin? Are you doing good? Got another Snapchat. Also, I need to get a new phone. Mine is... Mine is not doing great. But... Oh, I have... Okay. I love my friend to death. But also, he's kind of... I don't know, the way he said it. So, like, I have a personal TikTok, obviously, where I, like, I've posted some stuff, obviously, just because it's, like, why not? It's a fun thing to do. He's like, I could try to watch yours, but they're really cringe. And I'm like, you don't have to say that. I'm sorry, Alex, if you're watching, but, like, I'm being supportive. Yours are very cringe. I just am a good person and don't say that because I know that could hurt your feelings. Because it hurt mine. <laughs> Oh, that's awesome. Congrats, dude. Aw, oh, that must be so nice. But, yeah, no. I... We're just, we're vibing. We're vibing in my quarantine dorm. I feel like it's gonna be really loud here. I don't know. I just, I feel like people are gonna be very loud and, like, talk a lot during the night. Or at least very loudly, even though they're in their own rooms. I also have a weird feeling that people are not going to stay in their rooms. I know that because I know in the other quarantine dorm they were treating it kind of like little parties. Because it's like, well, we're already isolating, might as well isolate together, which I don't understand. But go off, I guess. But, yeah, no, we, we're just, we're vibing right now. This is, this is definitely the plans I have for my weekend, and for next week, and maybe the week after. Yeah, if I, so I'm getting a COVID test, test next Saturday, just because for exposure apparently that you have to wait eight days. So I'm doing that, and then on this Saturday, and then I'll get the results, and if I get the results then, I'll get out on most likely the 23rd. If they're positive or something else, then I have to stay till the 26th, 20, it's either 26th or the 27th, it's two weeks. So we are, 
it's gonna be it'll be interesting but at least y'all won't get streams for consistently for two weeks maybe i'll do some all day ones who knows who knows <laughs> oh But yeah, I don't know, it's just, it's very weird to be not in my room and not being able to go back to my room for two weeks. I'm going to miss it a lot. I'm also going to be very lonely, I realize, because I was realizing it today, because normally when my roommate leaves to like go and work in the library all day, or this weekend she actually has been, um, like this weekend, she was she went down to North Carolina to go and hang out with uh, her boyfriend. I don't know, but um, so she wasn't there when I got exposed, at least, which is good for her. But it's also like, like I'm always so lonely when she's gone. So like, this is gonna be so fun. Um, I mean, at least I'll be able to make some videos for y'all, upload them. YouTube, I guess. I don't know. Who knows? We'll see. We'll make some more TikToks. I don't know. I don't really have plans for my quarantine. I thought I did, and then I didn't. So, but I have air conditioning now. I'm really happy about that. I have air conditioning that works. Whoever would have thought. Like, that's actually, it makes me very happy that I have air conditioning that works, because I did not, I don't have air conditioning that works in my dorm room. It's also going to be weird having my bed closer to the ground, because normally I'm in a loft bed, which is what I'm sitting under. So, also, the way they did it was very weird. I got here, and like, you just, you move in yourself, and you don't check in with anybody at all. All of, like, the desk I'm using, the desk back there, I heard I'm like, <laughs> um... And then I have a little side desk here, and there's a desk right by my sink. Is I moved it all because of like the fact that like um because it was all just under here, and I'm like I kind of need a desk to work a little bit. But and then it also came with rolly chairs, so I have two of those. So one's still under my bed. I'm obviously sitting in one. Who is Snapchatting is the question. I don't think I get food tonight, though. Just because I checked in today. I don't know. And none of my friends are here, so they can't drop it off. <laughs> if I were to, like, get something from, like, the dining halls. Because I can't leave. So. We really love to see that. Oh, we got Loki and Fall Dweller. Nice. My friend is Snapchatting me. He is currently also in Charlotte with his old girlfriend. Imagine having a significant other. Couldn't be me. <laughs> oh, I mean, I'm fine, though. Yeah. Like, it's... I kind of enjoy being single, I've realized. Yo, how do I get into this? Yeah. Um... Just get exposed to COVID. Oh, it's not fun. I can tell you that already. Like, I haven't even been here for that long. I've been here for an hour. I've been here for an hour. Holy shit. I guess I unpacked and getting my bed made took a lot longer than I thought. But. Damn. But Grace, if you would like to see me stream every day from my quarantine dorm. <laughs> Uh, thank you. <laughs> I need a re-diet. I haven't dieted. I needed- blah, 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 blah. I need a re-diet. It's been a while. <sighs> it's just fading a lot, especially in the back. So, that's fun. But I can't exactly do that, so. Love to see it. But, yeah. We're just reviving. Give me, give me topics to talk about, because I don't know what to talk about. I never do, and then I'll go off on a tangent, and then I won't know what to say for, like, later. I feel like my camera quality is really bad, because I don't have a light. Like, I have a little overhead light, but I don't have my little light on the side anymore. 
I'm very sad about that. Um, I brought my mouse, made sure of that. I don't know, I, I generally don't know. Yeah, I feel like that wouldn't work, like, even if it could. Logistically speaking, I feel like that wouldn't work that well just because of... No, I don't. I just really, like, I got a dinosaur thing. I mean, most- I have three tattoos. All from different places, actually. I got- This one I got in Edinburgh, Scotland. Um, that, this was my first one. I'm really happy with this. This one I've wanted for four years. This one was slightly impulsive. I got, like, one of the ink box tattoos. Um, thank you. And I really- it's- his name is Maury. I got him in- actually, I think it was in North Carolina. I'm assuming you're talking about the semicolon is super basic. I mean, I guess, but I didn't really want, like, an extravagant thing. Like, it's just- like, it's a simple little thing. It doesn't- it's not supposed to be huge. I mean, especially because it's just, like, a meaningful thing for me. Like, I know there's a huge, like, semicolon project, but, like, I like it. But yeah, no, the dinosaur, I got, like, an inkbox one, which is, like, the temporary tattoos, and I really, really loved it. And I was like, I really want this, like, permanently. So then I got it permanently in North Carolina during my summer job. I love him. His name is Maury. He's a space dinosaur. And then I have one of my thigh, which I cannot show, um, terms of service shit, but it is a dragonfly inside of a jar. My friend drew it. I got it done actually here in Virginia because we have a, of course, it's a college campus. Why wouldn't we have a tattooing parlor and stuff here? Um, but that one that I really like as well because my friend drew it. <laughs> nah, the semicolon one is, so like the whole meaning, um, you're good. The whole meaning behind like the semicolon thing is it's this huge project called the semicolon project and it's for like people who are allies of like those who struggle with depression and like suicide and shit as well as those who have like struggled with it themselves so like it's kind of like the author doesn't it, the way i best describe it is like the author doesn't want to continue the sentence but they still do and that relates back to like my life and other people's that i know's lives of like not wanting to continue but still continuing anyways so like that's something i've wanted i wanted for like at least four years so i'm getting or apparently i'm not getting my hoodie hold on but yeah thank you yeah i really want more i want i want to get a thistle going up my rib just because it's i love scotland so like i just i want to move to scotland one day um, it's really pretty. It's just been something that I love. Um, and so, and that this was the national flower of Scotland. I want to get, oh, that squeaked. Um, I want to get like a full doodle sleeve itself. Um, I have some that my friends drawn, drawn. I can speak words. So I'm really excited for that. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm very excited to get more tattoos. Uh, I just need the money for it. I, uh, I need to email about, I was supposed to have a job, well not even a job interview, I was supposed to go show my I-9 documents on Tuesday, but I'm now quarantining, so can't exactly do that. But it's fine, it's not like I've been wanting to work since January. It's fine. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll take this time to remind you, I, like, follow you should follow so that way you can watch my streams every day this this coming two weeks i'm entertaining i promise i actually am normally i normally have been playing minecraft and among us and stuff but like because when i moved back to my college dorm oh nice in january oh thank you <laughs> uh, but yeah when i moved back to my college dorm in january my laptop does not run as well as my desktop does back home. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so thank you for the follow though. I appreciate that. Uh, but yeah, no, I 
I haven't been able to stream those, of course, just because of the fact that my laptop does not run. I mean, my laptop doesn't even really run streaming that well, to be honest. Like, if you go back and look at some of the VODs, they there is definitely some moments where it's like, ooh, that's not that good. Um, but yeah, I should have brought my portable charger. I was thinking about that, and I realized that, and I was like, look, just because I only have one charger on my bed and one over by my fucking, like, sink, and I can't use it over there, so... That and my phone is at like 20%. My phone just keeps, my phone does not hold battery at all. I need to get a new one. I need to get an Android. I know most people don't like it. I really like Androids. <laughs> um, because I have an iPhone at the moment. But, but yeah, I don't know. It's very weird looking and it, that and the charger, there's a plug on the wall there behind my laptop and it doesn't come up enough to wear. Exactly. Like, I just, I feel like Android works really well. Oh, nice. Yeah, my friend, he has an Android, and I really like it. Like, it's so much easier to use, and it has, like, a bunch of the features and stuff, and so I'm like, all right. But, yeah. I don't know. I like iPhone just because, like, it is slightly easier to use, just because, like, everybody has one. But it's also, like, meh. I don't know. I also know that Androids hold battery a lot longer. Um, so, who knows? What song I'm listening to right now? I have Animal Crossing music on because I don't want to get it copyrighted. I feel like someone would say in the order of the songs, but they don't. That is very disappointing. But it's okay. That's fine. Uh, yeah. And most people use iPhones for, like, everything else. So. I'm sorry. I keep getting distracted. I keep hearing voices outside. They never are. They really aren't. That and my phone screen is very cracked at the moment. So I, for some reason, I've never gotten a screen protector. I don't know why. But I just haven't. Um. But yeah, no. So I honestly might start saving up so I can get a new phone instead. Oh, what if I just shine a light on my face? That doesn't even work that well. <laughs> but we love, we really, I also, but yeah, no, I have plans for this quarantine to start making videos so I can upload those to YouTube so y'all can at least have like some of my normal content. You don't know any of the normal content just because I'm you just joined, but um, I used to stream a Minecraft in Among Us. It was very fun. Um, who was talking to this? I don't like that. <laughs> I keep getting distracted by it. I did do a photo shoot in my, in my prom dress. I've done two. Oh, you've probably seen my Instagram. Um, wait, you're not me. Hold on, who was the other person that followed? I Are you Fletcher Winks? Because that is the only other person that is following me on here. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I need to post more on it. I just don't know what to post on it. I might post a quarantine... Oh, I could do a quarantine photo shoot. No. Are you on my main? Hold on. <laughs> to be honest, there's a lot of people that could be on my main at this point. Either that. Uh, oh. <laughs> yeah, no, I get that. Okay, are you talking about a purple dress Or like... A sparkly holographic purple one. I guess that will tell me which account. Because I have technically two. Because one is my personal one. Which I should private, but I don't think I can because of sorority things. I don't know about that. I should probably figure that out. But yeah, no, I have 
my own private one, or yeah, my personal one, and then the one for streaming, which I don't know what to post on there. It just felt weird using my personal one as well for streaming. I don't know why, but... Oh, yeah, so then that's my, that is my uh, Instagram for streaming-wise. But, um, yeah. Yeah, that is my streaming Instagram one. Yeah, it's a it's like a lavender. In the lighting, it was a different color, kind of a little bit. But I liked those. Those were good photos. Did those all by myself at like midnight. <laughs> because what else? What else would you do? You know? I can see how it looks a little pink. That's fair. But yeah, no. I don't know. I mean, you just you just gotta do photo shoots sometimes. I know guys don't normally do it, but like they're fun. They're enjoyable. <laughs> Wait, so how'd you find me, Goose? I'm very curious. Were you just like going through like the just chatting tab? Damn, I don't get a lot of people that do that. That's impressive. Either that, or I'm assuming TikTok, because I have that as well. So. <laughs> But they moved me to the quarantine. Oh, <laughs> uh, I mean, mine. That one was from my junior year of high school, actually. And then I have a different one that I haven't posted on my like Twitch, uh, Instagram. That sounds very weird to say, but um of the other prom dress I had from senior year that I didn't get to wear. Uh, I wish I could have worn that one so badly. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you. Um, but yeah, no, I had one from senior year that I didn't get to wear because of COVID. So that, that really sucked. I really liked that dress too. It was really pretty. Yeah, Twitch to groom. Yeah, that sounds about right actually. But I also need to make a Twitter, because I know a lot of people use that, and I just haven't made it yet. I should put that on my list. We'll figure it out. I have already a growing list of things that I need to do. Oh wait, I need to get emotes also. Because I'm affiliate. That's insane. That's, I, you have not heard me talk about this. It is insane to me that I'm affiliated. It's insane that I can run ads, that ads occasionally run in front of my videos. It's insane I have subscribers. I have one. It was very exciting. I got him. I got a subscriber ooh, two days ago, I think. Yes, two days ago. It's, I, oh, it was so cool. I, oh, never expected that. I never expected to be able to, like, get affiliated on Twitch. To be fair, I started streaming just because I was like, oh, I'm bored. Like, I might as well, because it was back in November when I started. Because it was during my, like, my school's winter break slash Thanksgiving break. And it, it's just, it's so fun. It's, you get a nice, like, you can definitely get a really good community from it, too. I need to figure out how to make a server for everybody. Thank you. <laughs> Holy shit. Thank you so much. Holy shit. <laughs> Thank you for the sub. Damn. <laughs> I don't remember what I was talking about now. <laughs> Whoever just joined, I'm so sorry. Oh, thank you. Oh, yeah, I feel that. I think technically I have one because I have the student Amazon Prime thing, so I think that means I can. I don't know. I haven't figured it out yet. I might do it. Um, there's one streamer that I really like who, I don't know, her, she just, just has very chill vibes. So, but no, I need to make emotes. I also need video. That's what I was writing down. I used to do YouTube videos. It was on Sims, but, and that's been a while. 
I kind of miss it, but my laptop also could not run that. But no, I think I'm gonna do Stardew in Minecraft, obviously. I might do some Among Us ones. We need to- I need everyone to play Among Us again, even if it's not streaming it. It's so fun, especially like actually getting to talk to people. I have a little- I have like a Discord that if you wanted to join, it's in my about section. But I need to get everyone to play Among Us again soon. Like that just sounds really fun. It was, I mean, it was fun. I was a little too good at it occasionally. I had, oh, it's one of my favorite. It's not even, it can't, it's not a clip, but like one of the little highlights of like, it was a five minute one because both of the games were like two to three minutes long because I found the imposter both times really quickly. The first time I think was by deduction. The second time was because there was no other logical way. Like he came up from the same area where the body was and was trying to say he came from security. And I was like, wait, no. <laughs> yeah, I know. Then I said that the, whoever's the imposter needed to kill me next. And then they did. And I was like, good. Because I 100% will be able to figure out how it is. It's just, it's such a fun, I haven't played in a while. I need to. I I actually really need to. I miss it. I haven't played in a while. Just because it's so hard, especially playing online with people you don't know. Just like the typing for it. Like it's just, it is very difficult to play that way. But, um, what games do you play? What games would you like to see? I need, I'm starting to get into, a well I haven't even started Apex. I downloaded it. Because my friend's also in isolation. He was like, hey, we should play. And I was like, all right, I'll do that. I wasn't even originally going to do it because I was in quarantine. Originally, it was because I was just being a good friend. And then I got put in quarantine. So it's like, well, <laughs> guess I should now. But I don't know. What games would y'all like to see? Because I have Apex. I have... What else do I have? I have Undertale. I might do another playthrough of that because I haven't played that in so long. I miss it a lot. But I mean, also, these wouldn't be streamed is the only thing, which kind of sucks. Like, it would have to be on YouTube. Unless I can do, like, can I prim I don't know if I can premiere videos. If I can, then I might do that. Just because of the fact that, like, so it's still technically on Twitch. But even if I wasn't on it originally, if that makes sense. Um... I'm gonna get hungry. I should have brought snacks. I'm realizing this now. I'm supposed to bring snacks and I didn't bring many snacks because I couldn't fit them and now I'm very disappointed in myself. It's fine. But, um, yeah, no, I, yeah, I might do Undertale, obviously Stardew. I had a farm that I started on when I was streaming back home. Um, it was the new beach farm because I was checking out the whole new update. The whole new update is so cool. Like, I just, I, it, Concerned Ape is really good at, at like, making a game. It's insane. Um, obviously I'll do start my- start, I'll do Minecraft again. I'm excited for that one. I mean, I'm gonna have to restart my world is the only thing. Or I'll just have to play on the server that me and my friends have, just because of the fact that it doesn't transfer between computers, and I completely forgot that. This, Cause, like, I booted it up on this- like, on this laptop, and it completely slipped my mind the fact that my files don't save from my desktop to this laptop for Minecraft, and I was very sad about that. But, yeah. <laughs> um, I don't know what else to talk about. The water here is very, it's concerning a little bit. Tastes interesting. Tastes kind of like, I think it was cute. Oh, I dropped my pen. Hold on. We'll, I, we'll take another sip to figure this out. I don't know, but it doesn't taste like water. <laughs> I don't know. It's from the sink, and you would think it's fine to drink. Normally it is, but like, I don't know. I got this from the sink in my dorm because I can't leave to get water. And because I moved in at 12, I don't have the meal thing. So I can't fill that out. I couldn't fill that out until tonight. So I don't get dinner. <laughs> I probably should have eaten before. Well, I should have eaten before. Also, I don't have a microwave or anything in here. 
My friend, he has one in his dorm. Kind of bullshit. Just gonna, just saying. Um, but yeah, no, I, it is, it is concerning. I kind of wish I had like a filter or something. That's true. Still is concerning, but I mean, I'll have to drink it anyways, because it's, you need water to survive. But yeah, no, I, oh my god, I have, so I have the pox up there, and that has like a bunch of disinfectants and shit in it, and in it came this and one other like fucking snack bar, and I was like, alright, put it in with the disinfectants and the detergent. Okay. Um, also, if I want to do laundry, I have to wash it in the sink and then air dry it. It's where I'm really living in luxury right now. Really, really living in luxury. But it's fine. I have my dab pen and that's all I need. Yup. Oh, I, it is... I, yeah, I'm sure this is the most entertaining stream. How long? I'm here. Well, I get tested in eight days. So I get tested next Saturday. Um, if that comes back negative, then I'm allowed to leave uh, on the 11th day. But if it doesn't come back negative, then I have to stay until the 27th. And that's when I get a check out. So it's going to be, it's going to be interesting. That is for sure. Yeah, so I'll have a lot of time on my hands. Too much time on my hands. <laughs> so, I don't know, I'm already- it is- it is lonely in quarantine. Um... <laughs> but, yeah. Also, I have zits on my head at the moment, because, you know, that is- I mean, that is how being a human works, but I just- they're very red at the moment, so I'm very sorry about that. Um, yeah, no, I'm not excited to be here for a solid two weeks. It's not gonna be fun, I can tell you that already. But, um... Sorry, I'm reading the pen. It's a Disney pen. It says Sea Dog Bail Bonds. Because they had this cute little, like, they have a bunch of these different pens that are based around the different rides uh, that are at Disney, and they're really cute. Like, there's one that's like Madame de Leo's, like psychic tarot readings and stuff. I'm like, I like that. But I don't know. I feel like I'm gonna get a roommate within the two weeks that I'm here, just because I know my luck, and I also know that like, actually, I haven't even looked at the numbers for how many quarantine rooms or like how many people are in quarantine. COVID, Virginia Tech. I don't know what the name of it used to be. COVID-19 information. Um, where was it? Hold on. I don't know where it is, because they used to have like an entire... Oh wait, here it is. Maybe? The dashboard. That's what it was called. It was called the COVID dashboard. Big brain. Uh, I was exposed to somebody who had COVID, so like, and it was only one person. So like, I went and her and I, like, we shared a drink yesterday at 12. She had already, like, she got randomly tested earlier in the week, but she hadn't gotten her results back. She was asymptomatic. Um, and at 5, at like 5 p.m., she then texted me, hey, so I just tested positive for COVID. So I was like, oh, great. So I stayed inside and then called this morning. It was like, hey, I was exposed to COVID. And they were like, cool, thanks for telling us. Go sit in this dorm for two weeks now, please. It's like, all right. <laughs> well, there's only 176 of us in isolation quarantine spaces. But it's like, the numbers have been spiking here, at least. Uh, or at least for Virginia Tech. And I mean, to be fair, it is the beginning of the semester, I guess. But it's also like, it's a lot of 
it's a lot of people that have tested positive. Or at least that I know of. Like, there's so many people that are in quarantine or isolation that I know personally. And there were not that many last semester. So I don't know what's happening this semester that just everyone was like, yes, I'm getting COVID now. But I don't know. I am very nervous. I don't think I'll actually get it. I think I'm just exposed and obviously I'm going to take the preventative measures of making sure I'm isolated and not like coming in contact with anybody because I would feel so bad if I inadvertently like hurt someone or got them infected. So, me. Like it wasn't even a big party. It was, a, it was literally one person. <laughs> like what the fuck? <sighs> like what are the odds of that? Of I don't go to any huge parties or any huge gatherings and I'm very COVID safe and I take a drink from one person's cup and whoop, guess I have to, guess I was exposed. <laughs> like my sweet mates last semester, one of them had it and the other one had to be put in isolation anyways because she lived with the other girl. And like both my roommate and I tested negative for it. Sorry, I just hit the microphone. But like both me and my roommate tested negative for it. So it was like, oh, well that kind of worked out. But then this time, it was like, ha ha, psych, you thought. I love that so much. It is, it is so great. I need to, oh, I can curate my playlist. I need to write that down too. Stream playlist. Awesome. I have so many things to do now. I have a nice list. I also have a book I've been meaning to read for like at least since the beginning of August. It's what everybody is saying. It's a psychology book. Um, I'm very excited. I haven't read in a while, or at least for fun. So I'm excited to read. <sighs> but And then they also left a pillowcase here from the last person. So that's just sitting back there. Yep. But yeah, no, I also have, I have a little shroom chocolate. Which I probably, I don't know, I thought about doing it while in quarantine, but also I feel like that's not a smart idea. Like, just for the fact of I wouldn't have somebody with me. But, we'll see. We will see, that is for sure. I have two weeks to figure stuff out. I also have Just Dance on my Switch, so I'll probably play that, or at least on my own I'll play that at some point. Um, I could start working out. Maybe. Probably not, but maybe. <laughs> um, I don't know, I want to finish, and I could finish, I have like my journal of, I don't know what that was, but I have a journal of short stories in there. Um, I've wanted to f like finish filling it up for like a year, or at least the past year, so like I have a good amount of pages filled. Like it's out of 200, and I'm up to... I'm up to page 124 so I'm getting there and I have enough time so I probably can finish filling it out also I painted the covers of it so I have the inside cover for that and then on the back cover I have that yeah this is I really like this one and I've wanted to paint the back or at least like this little spot here and like down here and cover up like the barcode and like the for every UV item you buy just because I did that on the front. Because I really like the constellation part of it. But I also don't have any paints with me. So that's something I have to wait for until I'm back at home. Like home home in Georgia. Sorry, my thing. It's also weird having a non-cushioned chair. Because I have... The chair I have back at my dorm has cushions already. This is just like a standard plastic chair. That rolls. What's in which thing? <laughs> I'm assuming you mean the journal. In the journal. It's just a bunch of different like little short stories or like ideas for short stories. Um, I have like a little bit of like a play in it at one point. Yeah, it's just short stories that I've written. Um, Like, I'm trying to find, like, a really short one. Uh, 
I like one that's one of my favorites. I don't know, there's also just a bunch that I need to finish that I had started and I didn't finish writing. Like we have the first day of school, because it was also technically for a class originally. I had a creative writing class that I used to do my senior year of high school and we had to do, like we had our journals and we had to. Oh no, it's not, I literally, I can't keep a diary. I forget about it a bunch. Um, yeah, no, they're all just short stories that I've written. Like they're all at least like just a page, not even a full page sometimes. Like I have an idea for like a midlife crisis on your like deathbed, which wouldn't be a midlife crisis, but like existential crisis, if you may. And I mean, also a bunch of the prompts were like, we all made prompts. So we put them in like this little cup and people would pull them out and like figure out, oh, okay, we'll write this. So also making it so you wouldn't, you can't stick to just your style of like writing and ideas normally. Uh, like we have one where it was like you're the child of a Nazi and like you have to and like you found out your friend or someone you know uh, was Jewish during like the time of like World War II and so like we had to write a short story for that uh, we had one where it was like just the where it was called perfect match and I took that um my first line, I'm just very proud of it. I was like, we were the perfect match. Maybe that's why we burnt out. I liked that one a lot. I thought that was a pretty good one. Um, I don't know, I have a bunch of different ones. I'm trying to find like a really good one. I also like to title them just because it helps me practice like creating titles. Oh, this is one of my favorites. It was called Coffee Dreams. I'll show, try to show the page. You can't read it, but like, just because of the light. But I, it was just like a list, because we had to get in like 20 prompts for one of our, th like, for one of our uh, assignments, like, ooh, last year, 2019. Um, and it could be anything at all. And so I made a list of like, ways to not fall asleep. And like, as you read the list, like, it's like, Coffee, watching a funny movie, exercise, dancing to some snazzy music, more coffee, um, blast cold air in your face, play ghost games, um, create a piece of art, clean your room. Did I mention coffee? Um, and like it, it kind of feels normal and then it starts to go to like summon a demon. Give your demon some coffee. <laughs> um, make friendship bracelets with your new demon friend. Play some video games with the demon. And then it goes, uh, hide from your demon after beating it in my Mario Kart. Um, and then it switches to like the demon. So the way I did it, and you can see it very much so at the bottom, if I can get the camera to focus on it, maybe you can see that it switches to really bad handwriting because I switched from writing with my right hand to my left hand for it. It was like innovative. <laughs> I had a big brain moment there, but I don't know. I really need to finish filling it out just because I wanted to, because it's 200 baby pages. Oh really? But um, and tell me about this girl you used to work with. Also, what kind of work? I like learned about the people who I have in my chat as well as like in my little community. Ah. The zipper keeps falling on the chair, and I feel really bad because it keeps making noise. Um, yeah. Sorry, it's I'm I'm fine with the music. I also need to eat at some point. I don't know. I'll figure that out. <laughs> but I might. I don't know what I'll do. Ooh, a building supply store. All right. Nice. Oh, nice. <laughs> I don't know. I haven't really met many people like me, I guess. But nice. That's, that's really cool, actually. Um, hopefully she was also nice. <laughs> but, I don't know. I, I'm going to write a little note to myself to do an Among Us. Among Us. 
Twitch. Because I won't be able to stream it. But we can all play it together. Do I sing? Not really. <laughs> I'll like sing along to songs if I am listening to them. But normally on my own. Just because I'm very self-conscious about it. Oh, uh, okay. I mean, I feel like I'm not always afraid to speak my mind. I also just don't want to offend anybody. I don't know. I... I don't know. I've said to my friends, I don't really care about getting cancelled. And this is... Okay. This is gonna sound so controversial. Controversial? I could speak. Because, um... Most people who say what I'm about to say are only saying it because they're trying to be racist or sexist or, like, homophobic online. But, like, I feel like people definitely are a little too sensitive in 2021 and kind of have lost direction as to where we should be thinking of things. Of, like, I don't know, like, getting upset over someone using a specific hair in, like, a video game. Like, yeah, that's not something I'm gonna do, but it's also, like, yeah. I don't know, like, it just, it does feel like sometimes you have to be very, like, way too careful with what you say. And even then, you can still get cancelled from it. It's like, damn, all of us kind of need to take a chill pill. And, like, and it's also a huge thing of, like, stepping back and thinking, hey, this is actually a productive thing that I'm about to say. Or is this something that is dumb and I could just move on with my day? Like, there's a bunch, um, I don't know if you have TikTok, but, like, there's one where it's, like, showing a bunch of different art and stuff, and then it's, like, add a little bit of spice, and it, add, and it shows, like, the product that the person who made the TikTok's making. So, like, normally it'll be a bunch of images from, like, Google or some shit, um, and then it shows like the person's products and everyone in the comments is like oh I hate this trend so much like it just puts people down and it's like it's not it's not though like literally most people search up on google like oh like wind chimes and they put in the generic photos of that it's like are you really are you really gonna be that upset about a trend doing that like <laughs> I'm sorry what <laughs> like maybe it's just me but I just Okay. Oh, that was absolutely horrible. People who say like, oh, I don't see color. Like you're allowed, you can see that someone is black or like brown and stuff. You just can't be racist. <laughs> like it's a literal, like they're born that way, literally. So it's okay to see that. It's okay to say that. It's just like, you can't say racist shit that way, though. Like, saying I don't see color is- it, it is fairly problematic. Um, like, that is- <laughs> oh, I don't know, people nowadays- 2021 is- it's a fucking year. It's also, like, people looking back at, like, different TV shows and stuff and are like, oh, like, this wouldn't fly now. Like, yeah, it wouldn't fly now because- y'all are saying like just because it, you're saying it would be problematic but like it, it wouldn't be most of the time do you know what's maybe oh yeah exactly like it's very much like if you're directing someone like being like oh yo yeah like that person over there it doesn't care as long as it's not like being derogatory when like talking about it then uh, then yeah obviously it's like, fine exactly so i don't know it's just it's very it's being careful about the way you say things but like yeah no i agree with what you're saying for that but yeah no i don't know it's just it is 2021 is wild and that is for sure like i don't know if you've ever watched um What's it called? Clone High. Oh, that was so good. I thought it was really funny, personally. It's on, like, all of the episodes are on YouTube. I personally think it's really funny. Maybe that's just me. But it's also, I think they're trying to reboot it. 
and that's gonna be interesting to see how they reboot it just because of the fact that there's a lot of jokes and stuff in it really damn <laughs> I mean, I feel like I'm probably not that old. I don't know. I think I'm old sometimes. I'm almost 19. That's insane to me, first of all. <laughs> like, people have called me old on TikTok, and I'm like, hold on a second. <laughs> yeah, it's going to one of the major providers. I know they're probably taking Gandhi out of it, which, I mean, I don't really give a shit about. Personally, I didn't really like his character. I didn't really think he was that funny. I know he was supposed to be the comedic relief, but, like, I mean, to be fair, it wasn't- it's also just not my kind of humor for at least him. JFK Loki was kind of the comedic role. I just- I want to know what happened. Like, I really wish I'd- they'd been able to make a second season of it. Just because I really wanted to know what was going to happen at the end. Also, Abe's a bitch. <laughs> just saying this. I do not like Abe. I don't like- I, I hope- not a lot of people like Abe. Oh, yes, I love this song. Sorry. I realized I was old yesterday, or not yesterday, two days ago when I was streaming because I was talking about Animal Crossing and I was trying to figure out which one I'd played. And I'd played Wild World. That was like, that one came out forever ago. That was on the DSi. I was like, hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Like, that just, that's insane to me. I don't know if that's insane to some people, like just, I don't know, getting old is weird. I know I'm not old is the thing, like I know 19 isn't even gonna be that old, it just, it's like, huh. Like it's also just weird. Oh, that's insane. Oh, uh, yeah, I know, I don't know, it's just, it's very weird. Especially seeing, because I have younger siblings, and so it's very weird seeing how like, they're growing up versus how I grew up. Um. Especially because, like, I don't know, like, I rarely was ever on the computer, at least when I was, like, five and six. But now it's just such a normal thing. It's like, huh. Alright. <laughs> but, no. Um, yeah, no, I don't know, it's just, it's really weird. Especially because I have my DSi, I have the 3DS, which, I like, now that is an old console. Which is weird. Like... <laughs> um, I don't know. Sorry, I keep looking at my room. I'm not used to being in the quarantine dorm. I literally moved in at like 3.45, 3.50. So, but yeah, no, I don't know. I just, I don't know what I'll be doing for the next two weeks. I mean, I have to do schoolwork, classwork, obviously, but I also need to take notes tomorrow. I have a psych exam on the 10th or the 16th. I need to do that. <laughs> At least I need to take notes for it. You know, originally I was going to be alone this weekend anyways, because my roommate, she went down to Charlotte to see her boyfriend. Um, one of my other friends, yeah, exactly. I didn't really bring any photo shoot worthy clothes. I just kind of brought some comfy clothes because I'm, since I'm not leaving, so. But yeah, no, I have. Yeah, no, then my other friend, he also went down to Charlotte to see his girlfriend, two different One's in Queens, one's in Charlotte, Charlotte. And then the other friend, he's in quarantine. He's been there since, like, Monday. So I wasn't going to be alone anyways. But then now I'm alone for two weeks. So it's like, huh. All right. <laughs> Let's go. So. Uh, it's very exciting. We love to see that. Um, I don't even know how I could do a photo shoot. I mean, I could. Yeah, I might, honestly. Who knows? Post it on my Twitch to Graham. <laughs> oh. Oh. Also, I'm going to get hungry. I at least I'll lose weight or something, because I don't have a lot of food access for me. So, yeah, exactly. Oh, I mean, I go back and clip things anyways from streams. I like doing that. I like going back and like looking through clips. It's kind of nice. I've gotten a lot more used to my voice on video. I didn't used to like it at all. Like I used to absolutely hate how my voice sounded. And I mean, I still sometimes do. 
but like going back and listening to old like VODs and stuff to find clips for it, it helps a lot. Especially because I know generally exact moments from it too, but an Instagram notification, whoa. I don't know, it's very exciting. You know, I'm also in a sorority, so I'm supposed to have basket week starting tomorrow. But, oh yeah, no. <laughs> um, yeah, exactly. But yeah, I don't know, I was supposed to have basket week, which is where you get like the little goodies and stuff. I don't know, I think I explained this in the beginning of the stream. I don't remember what I explained or not. But, um, where like, you're supposed to get clues as to who your like, big sister in the sorority is. And because of how many people are just in isolation, they're, they had to move it online, which is like, that's, that's insane. I don't think it's ever been online. Like, they've never had to do something like that before. And it kind of sucks because it's normally such a huge thing. But like, I'll be in quarantine for it. The person who I really want to be my big, she is going to be in quarantine. But I don't know if I have her yet. But the way they did it this year is they made a bunch of different Instagrams for all of us. So I'm excited. I really like it. I think it's, I mean, it's cute for like the way that they have to do it it works it's cute it worked out no it's just it's very weird it's also very weird being a story because i never thought i would be like all through high school i never saw myself joining one and then like first year of college like freshman year of college just is such a lonely time so i was like well might as well and then i don't know it's always very cheesy and everybody always says this, but like, I don't know, I'm really glad I did. I've met some really cool people at least. I know it's a very cheesy thing to say and most people are like, uh, ha. Huh. Wow, look at you being a cheesy stereotypical sorority girl. <laughs> I mean, I don't even look like one also at least. Like, I got my nose ring, I got the septum, I used to have dyed hair. I really miss my dyed hair so much. I want to dye it like pink or something again, but I also need to give my hair a break for a while just because I dyed it a lot last semester, but I really want to dye it again. I miss it. <laughs> so, I don't know. What, did, what colors did I do last semester? I did blue, green. I started off with like a nice purplish violet thing. No, it's not. I also dyed my hair this color. Um, it used to be kind of close to this color, though, because in senior year, that was the closest my hair was to natural. I could probably pull up a photo. No, my hair is normally, like, brown-ish, but, like, here, hold on. It had highlights in it. Give me a second to find it. Okay, I am getting close to before I dyed my hair. No, I'm not. That's in December. November. Okay. I just need a photo of the hair. Where? Oh, where is it? Hold on, wait. What day is this? Because if I figure out... Okay, this one's the beginning of the month. I had the photo shoot near the end. Here it is. So, like, this is gonna be a horrible trying to focus it and make sure the camera doesn't, like... Eh. There we go. Oh, I had it for a second. Okay, you can't really see the hair, but it was, like, a brown mixed with some, like, genderish highlights. But, yeah. <laughs> oh, I feel like I might end the stream soon. I don't know, I'm very tired. I didn't take a nap today. I meant to, but like I was awaiting the call for like, hey, you need to move into a quarantine dorm. I know, I really liked it. As much as I love dyeing my hair, I am very excited for when I can get that color back at least, just because I really liked it. I could just, I was very, very happy with it. But I also wanted to dye my hair because dyeing hair is very fun. So. <laughs> you know, the moment I have like, it's very cotton candy like kind of like there's some blue and there's some pink underneath and i don't know why i don't know how like i even bleached it in like december to try to get like the color out and it just kind of worked but not really so we're just i'm just here 
I also don't remember the exact color I used last time. I know it was like an auburn sort of color. So I'm going to try and find the one that it was so I can re-dye it again because it was really good. I liked it because it was slightly darker. You could see it in, I mean, you could see it in the prom scene, or prom scene? Photo shoot for, in the prom dress. Um, now my hair is like a nice darker red. So I really want to get that color back. But it lasted for a good while too. It lasted like at least like three or four weeks. So, nah, but I still have like, I still have pink dye, blue. No, I don't have blue anymore. I have pink, green, black. I have like a maroon-ish red. I know, yeah. <laughs> No, I, I, yeah, I meant the photo shoot for in my prom dress. Nah, you could see it in it, too. I also don't sit on chairs normally, I've realized. I'm currently sitting, like, diagonally. The back of the chair is here. I am a bisexual, <laughs> truly. Just by sitting incorrectly in a chair. But yeah, no, I don't know, I miss it, though. I don't know, I'm always very torn between wanting to dye my hair a different color again and going back to natural. So, who knows? <laughs> I don't know, maybe once I'm out of quarantine, I'll just do that again. But, no, I don't know. How are y'all doing? How's your, how's your day been going? It's already, it's already 5.40. I might end the stream around like 6 so I can eat and work on college notes for my psych exam on Tuesday that I've been neglecting because college. I know, I wish, but I didn't bring any of my hair dye just because that would've, wouldn't have been smart. Plus I have to use a community. Ooh, that's, I'm, I've hurt my hair too much to try and use sketchy bleach. Nah, plus I would have to use the community bathroom. Those things scare me. They scare me a lot. Because <laughs> my dorm that I normally am in, it's a suite style, so we have a bathroom of our own, but like my roommate and I share it with, well, last semester we shared it with like four other people. This semester it's only two other people. It's still disgusting though. One of the girls leaves shit on the toilet. I don't get it. I don't know how you can do that. And I just, I don't, I don't know how you can do that and live with somebody at all, but like, okay. Um, yeah, no, I have a community bathroom that I haven't checked out yet. Very nervous to check out. But I'm gonna have to shower there for the next two weeks. So it really is. You would think if you share a space with others that you would clean up after yourself, but no. Apparently not. Oh, <laughs> um, but yeah. I don't know. What what would y'all like me to talk about? I'm out of ideas, out of topics. Give me give me something to talk about. Discuss. <laughs> Might open my window at some point. No, oh, it is nice to have air conditioning. Did not have that in my last one. We had to sleep with the windows open, which really sucks because it is so fucking loud all the time outside. Like, there will be people yelling at, like, 2 a.m. or some shit on, a, like, a Tuesday. And it's like, do you not have class tomorrow? Like, what, what the fuck are you doing? So, college. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, I definitely didn't organize another... Um, Among Us game with everybody in the Discord because that was a lot of fun. It was a lot. It was a lot of fun when we did it last time. Whoa, I have. What is hold on? What's fifteen plus six? Actually, it'll be fifteen plus five. Oh wait, that's twenty. I'm so smart. <laughs> You're all good, but. No, I need to make it so all of us can play Among Us again, because that was a lot of fun. Plus, it seems like the Wi-Fi here is slightly better. Not positive about that, but... Maybe. 
I also need to post on my other TikTok again. That's about to be really loud because I had that turned on. Also, I brought my AirPods and I don't know why because it's not like I kind of need them. Like, technically, I don't even need these earbuds, but I just feel weird not having them in and being in a dorm. I don't know. But I haven't posted in a... Well, I posted a few days ago. I posted... What did I post? Oh, I posted when I didn't know my mic was... I didn't know my mic was muted for, like, a solid 20 minutes. Like, about a week ago for one of my streams. And luckily nobody was there for, like, the 20 minutes. But then I think it was Fady joined. It was like, yo, your mic is muted. And I was like, ah, thank you. <laughs> but, no, I posted that. I have some other stuff. I don't know. Oh, wait, I wanted to check on my friend's account. He just got it. And love him to death. But, and so he kind of has blown up a bit. Or, yeah, he's up to 670 views on one of his TikToks. That's impressive. Good for him, though. But it was a Warhammer one, too. So he is, he is a nerd. Love him to death. But he's a nerd. <laughs> um, maybe I'll do that. I'll make some TikToks during quarantine. Upload those. Who knows? We'll, we'll just be. The world's my oyster. Not really, but this dorm is my oyster. This room is my oyster. <laughs> I. I don't know. It's gonna be interesting. I also don't have a lamp, so I can't exactly. Like, if I turn my light off, I'm in darkness. Ooh. Kinda wish there was a group me for this, like, for the dorm. Just because, like, I want to talk to people in the dorm as well. <laughs> but, yeah, I'm actually really hungry. It's fine. After this, I'll eat my oats and honeys bar that I got that was, that was put with my detergent and disinfectant. Ooh. I also need to organize. I used to play, we've been playing D&D with some of my friends here, which is a lot of fun. But also we haven't played in a while just because we haven't been able to. I don't know which thing I'm looking for. The fact that I am in a quarantine norm, the, the room is my oyster. <laughs> Oh, uh, that I got a nice Nutri Valley bar. Nature Valley. I don't know why I call keep calling it a Nutri Grain bar when it's not a Nutri Grain bar. <laughs> but how does Monday work for y'all? I'm now free whenever. <laughs> But, I mean, to be fair, I am now free whenever, so. I actually might do an all-day stream. I think that could be fun, of just working on, like, college work while streaming. Like, see who pops by, talking to whoever pops by. I think, that, I think that could be a lot of fun. Maybe. I'll talk about it in the Discord, and I'll ask if that's something that people would want to see. I don't know, the Discord's been very quiet recently, which kind of sucks. But I'm definitely gonna see who would like to play it among us. You're welcome to join. It's in the little panel section that I have on Twitch. Or yeah, on my about in my Twitch. Um No, it was a lot of fun. Plus Among Us is free technically on your phone. So all you would have to do is like use Discord to mute while I mean that's how we did it, was muting while we played and then unmuting during the meetings it's so much easier than typing in like the little the like the chat part that's always so difficult like on playing online games has any more friends to play that i might also suggest that to my friends too who knows i don't even have that many assignments due this week also i have like one essay one exam and a lab which is normal so not doing much. Oh, I have something to do tomorrow. Fuck. Hmm. My voice is way better? Thank you. <laughs> I don't personally think so, but I appreciate it. 
Oh, wait, yes, 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 yes. I'm so sorry. I have the worst memory in the entire world. Yes, voice with Among Us is a lot better. Especially when it's, like, with friends or, like, even, like, the community that I had. Like, when we played, it was so fun. Um, so I'm very excited about that. Yeah, I know, yeah, I, I realized after. Yeah. <laughs> I know. I, 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 but, yes, in the very occasion. Ah, oh, fuck. I keep accidentally hitting. Thank you. I do appreciate that. But, yeah, no, voicing games is so much fun. I, I've seen, like, a proximity for Minecraft one, and that one looks like a lot of fun. I need to figure out how to get plugins for the server that my friends and I are on. Just because, like, it would be a lot of fun to play on together and, like, have proximity. But we also don't play that much together. I also need to figure it out because... We don't know what we're gonna do for the cave update. I'm very excited about that. Oh, the fact they increased the block limit to like 384 and it now goes down to like, I think it's like negative 60 something. That is so exciting. Like, I'm, I'm very excited about that. I'm so excited for when it comes out. The warden looks scary as shit though. Like, I don't know if it's just me, but the warden's very scary. <laughs> but, I don't know. I don't know. Damn, that's insane that I have this many people. Holy crap. I don't know, it's just insane seeing my Twitch channel grow from something that was so small in November to like this. Like I, like one of my first ever viewers joined my stream a week ago, I think. And he was like, hold on a second, because he hadn't been in forever. He was like, last I checked, you had like seven followers, and now I was like, I'm now up to 84. Thank you for that. Um, and it's like, yeah, it's, it's so, it's insane. Like, I'm, I'm very grateful for it. Like, the opportunity I've had for this is just, it's so nice to like have had this opportunity. I don't know, I'm very grateful for it. But it's just, it's also just so insane to think that it happened. I never thought that it would happen. Like, I used to watch YouTubers and stuff and, like, see them and be like, wow, I really, like, it's insane to me that I am kind of like that for some people, like, a very small amount of people, but even then, it, like, being that for such a small amount of people still is insane. Like, I don't know, just, it's just so cool. Oh, but yeah. <laughs> and now I have up to two subscribers. That's just, that is so insane to me too. Like, holy shit. I just, and it's also kind of been building up on my own. Like, I haven't advertised it to any of my friends in real life. Like, until two days ago, only Alex destiny david only like five people knew that i streamed and so it really was like building up from like the ground up and i i don't know i think it's a lot of fun like i posted yesterday and i, I mean i got the ex the results i expected not really anybody that i know on snap is gonna join i knew that going into that and that was i was fine with that i will admit it made me very nervous just because i don't know i don't really I feel like I'm, I'm a much quieter person in, like, in person or, like, with friends and stuff. Like, I, my personality isn't different. It's just, on here, I'm much louder. I talk a lot more. I also talk about, like, different personal stuff. But, like, in person, I haven't really done that much with a bunch of my friends, or at least the people who I'm friends with on, like, Snapchat and things. So... It's just, it's very weird to see, I will admit. Like, at least personally, it's weird for me to see. But, yeah. Have a nice little happy bop for that somewhat depressing. <laughs> um, yeah, no, I don't know. It is weird, I will admit. I, I don't know. I always kind of question, like, um, like, why 
I don't know, like, why follow if, or not follow on here, but, like, I don't know, it just feels like I swipe up and, like, respond to a lot of people's stories, or, like, if they're doing something, I'll respond to it. Where am I most open? Um, I feel like on here I'm very open about, like, personal things, like, mental health and stuff. I know I've had a lot of different streams where I've talked about mental health and things. Um, one of, one of my, like, the packing stream that I have, it's up on my YouTube, um, I talked about, like, sexism and shit like that, of, like, um, just, like, gross comments that, like, the guys make, and I had two people, I had two different guys kind of prove my point, um, I don't even remember what it was, like, I don't even remember what they said, but it was, like, proving my point during it, and I was like, damn really just proved my point of what I was saying. I'm sure it's somewhere. I know it's in the VODs somewhere on YouTube, but like, I don't know. It's, I'm much more open here. I, I'm open to some of my friends, obviously. Like to the ones that I'm very close with, I'm open with them about different like personal issues and stuff. But like, I don't know. Here it's just kind of, I can be like my entire self here, if that makes sense. So, I don't know, like it's, I enjoy, I really enjoy streaming, so, but yeah, <laughs> I don't know, I also need to answer <sighs> Snapchats that I have from some people, I forget to, like I'll see it, I'll open it, and then I'll forget to reply, which is really bad, I have a really bad habit of that, but you know, I have a to-do list of, I need to make some YouTube videos, I need to commission emotes, I really need to do that. I'm very excited to do that. I'm excited to have my own little like, emotes. That's just, that's insane to me. Um, I also need to make like a little stream playlist so I can actually play that during the streams instead of just pulling up Animal Crossing music for like three hours. <laughs> um, and then also I need to say in the Discord, like, yo, who wants to play Among Us again? Maybe tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow. That actually could be a lot of fun. We'll figure that out. In a nice Valentine's Day stream. Damn. Damn, tomorrow's Valentine's Day. Oh. <laughs> You're good. Yeah, I know. I don't know. I also don't really give away. I will admit, I don't give away my personal information on here. Or, like, enough to where you'd be able to find my Instagram or, like, things like that. Just personally, because I like to keep the two separate. That's why I think, uh, one of, oh, thank you for following White Wolf. Um, yeah, I think with the following, like, adding me on Snap, that's, like, a 7,500 pixel thing, just because I know it will take a while to get to that. Um, but, yeah, no, I don't know, it's, it's definitely a balance, learning how to balance, like, this kind of life with personal as well. Like, I mean, obviously I can tell you what college I'm at. Like, that's a, like, that's something I don't mind saying. But, like, I don't think I've said my last name. I won't say it. Um, uh, okay, nice. Yeah, I'll make sure to message him and say things. Um, yeah, no, what else do I want to give? I mean, I give my age, but that's because that's a pretty normal thing, I feel. What else? Yeah, I, don't, I mean, I don't give, like, specifics. Like, I don't say exactly what dorm I'm in. Especially, I don't say what room I'm in. <laughs> um, but, like, I give definitely, like, information to, like, relate to me and, like, learn about who I am as a person, but not enough to, like, find me on the personal, like, on my personal Instagram or, like, Snapchat, I think. So. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, it's also just being careful online. Like, I know my community generally is really good about it. I just, I always, like it's, for me especially as a woman, I have to be very careful, like, a lot of the time. So, like I've talked about it in the past stream, I've had my nude sleep before. That was not a fun experience at all. <laughs> but like, it's just something, and it sucks to say, but it's just something that I have to. Exactly. I'm in the dorm. I mean, I'm actually in my in the quarantine dorm at the moment. <laughs> but I mean, that doesn't even give any information away as well. 
so like you can't figure out what room like you wouldn't be able to send mail or things like that like maybe in the future if i were to get larger i would set up like a p.o box or some shit but like that that, that is like a far very far future kind of thing that i would have to worry about but yeah i don't know Damn, i feel bad ending it now just because i'm not like three viewers and chatting and stuff but i actually have to I have to go do college psych notes to be a fucking I have to be a student fuck fuck that <laughs> um but yeah i'm gonna end it here i hope that y'all enjoyed the stream thank you again uh gooses89 so much for the subscription that's fucking insane to me thank you all for the follow um and yeah i hope that y'all have like i hope y'all have an amazing night i know i'm sorry but i mean i'll be streaming tomorrow <laughs> just because i'm in quarantine so i got nothing else to do but yeah i will see y'all tomorrow i'll message in the discord to try to set up an among us game i think that'd be a lot of fun um but yeah I hope y'all enjoyed today's stream, and I'll see y'all tomorrow then, so, bye. <laughs>